What up, you guys? So I'm here at Team Purple Panda, here to do another uh, card discussion. I'm going to talk about an uh, annoying little card that, um, you know, doesn't see as much play as it used to, but uh, back in the format where Black Wings reigned supreme, it was running around everywhere. A uh, card is Consecrated Light. For people who don't know what it does off the top of your head, uh, it basically goes like this. You can't normal summon dark mo you can't normal or special dark monsters. You can't attack with dark monsters. Uh, you know... Consecrated Light can't be destroyed by a dark monster, and re like regardless, you take like no battle damage or something like that. I think that's how it went. Uh, it's this little like fairy type puff ball that has like zero attack, zero defense, but it basically locks down like a deck that runs all darks. Literally, it was used to combat Black Wings when they reigned supreme, and it literally shut them down because you couldn't do anything. You couldn't summon any of your monsters because they were all dark. It hurts a Gravekeeper in a big way because you can't do shit against it. You know, like it hurts my deck. People have been wondering, you know, what are you siding against Gravekeeper? People have been saying Shadow Imprisoning Mirror, you know, it works. But I think Consecrated Light's also a big pain because you can't normal or special. So, I mean, I can't even, like, I can set, but that's about it. And, I mean, if you can get around my set monsters, like, I'm really kind of screwed. Because I can flip Spy, but I can't special summon anything. I can't really do anything. I don't even think I can flip it. Like, it really sucks. This little card is, you know, um, it's common, so it's easy to get. And a lot of people... You don't look past it, but I think it's a really good card. Um, against myself, I don't like it. I don't want to see it anywhere near my future when I play, because it's a little bit. It's it really is a little bitch of a card. I can't lie, because I run all dark monsters, so like, you know, it's like crap. It's like you know, how do I get around this thing? Because um, there's a reason why it's called consecrated light. We're literally like con we're like you should call it concentrated light, because you're literally just concentrating on light monsters. Like you can't even summon dark, and it's like wow. It's like you know, had this little puffball screw my whole strategy. You know, it's kind of crazy when you think about it. But it's a really good card, really good uh, side deck option. You know, right now, the main dark decks, I guess, are um, Blackwing and Gravekeeper. So I think that's it. So, I mean, that's what you could side it against if you really worry about those decks. I mean, I got a couple tech cards that, I mean... When I side my GKs, I add in some light monsters. So I might be able to get around Consecrated Light. I mean, they take no damage. So it doesn't really matter. But, uh, yeah, um, hard to get around, I have to say. Uh... I've actually had it happen once when I was running Black Wings, and oh god, did I have a devil of a time. I had to set volume and then pray that, you know, they'd summon something else so I wouldn't have to Icarus away one of my cards, and it finally did happen, so I mean, I got around it. But I mean, aside from that, that little bugger sucks, like literally, he just like locks down your whole game, and it's like, wow, you know, how could, like I said, like how could a little puffball cause so much trouble, but it's totally true. It's always the cards that look the most ridiculous that really hurt the most, so... Uh, yeah, Consecrated Light, you guys, definitely a really good check tech choice uh, if you know you're going to play against uh, a meta of where there's a lot of dark decks running around. Um, you know, like I said, it's good against Gravekeeper, good against uh, Black Wings. Uh, Samurai is not so much. I mean, they summon Sheehan, but I mean, pff, other than that, they could just run a little stupid thing over and then make Sheehan, so... Not really a good option, but I mean, aside from that, a uh, really cool card, really good side deck choice. Maybe not right now because of how the meta is, but in September, we don't know what's going to happen. Dark World will be coming back, so it is a really good card to have against Dark World since most of them are dark. So definitely it's going to be an interesting card, and we'll see what the format brings for Consecrated Light. But uh, that's all i got to say, you guys. You know, Leave me your feedback below. Please continue to rate, comment, and subscribe, and thank you for watching.